This is lesson 16 in our basic JavaScript section of Free Code Camp. Today's lesson, finding a remainder in JavaScript. The remainder operator gives a remainder of the division of two numbers. Example, 5 divided by 2, the remainder is 1 because math.floor, 5 divided by 2 is 2, 2 times 2 is 4, 5 minus 4 is 1. So that's kind of a a little bit confusing if you don't like piece it out piece by piece but the easier way to, to just think of this is 2 goes into the 5 two times that equals 4 so the rem remainder to get to 5 would be 1 so down here you'll see also the usage in mathematics number can be checked even or odd by checking the remainder of the division of the number by 2 so 17 divided by 2, remainder is 1, because 2 goes into 17 8 times, which would be 16, but with a remainder of 1. So this helps know the number is even or odd, because the next example, 48 divided by 2, gives us no remainder. So no remainder means it's divisible by 2, which means it's an even number. So note, the remainder operator is sometimes incorrectly referred to as the modulus operator. It's very similar to modulus, but does not work properly with negative numbers. Instructions. Set remainder equal to the... Um, rem, oh, set remainder equal to the remainder of 11 divided by 3 using the remainder operator. So, over here... Um, it's telling us set remainder equal to the remainder of 11 divided by 3. So here we're going to assign to remainder or set it equal to the remainder of 11 divided by 3. So this should say 3 goes into 11 3 times, which would be 9. So remainder would be 2, so what is stored in here would be the remainder of the division, which would be 2. So let's see if we're correct, and if so, that's it for this lesson. Remainder 2.